Welcome back to Minecrafting with Half Monty, right where I told you I'd be. Um, and I'm pretty much going to wing it. I got some ideas, just some basic general ideas of what I'm going to do here. Um, and that's about it. <laughs> I, uh, I'm going to kind of just cut off the area that I want to be limited to the spawner I'm going to be making. See No need to waste anything on these corners. Um, oh yeah, if you want to, you can take these boxes. I don't really... I got enough boxes. Actually, while I'm here... Yeah, cool. That's entertaining. <laughs> and if you're bored, um, enjoy some pirate music. Oh my god! <laughs> you butt fuckers. Green penises. Maybe that's what it is. Diarrhea. From being butt fuckers. I'm gonna have so much. Um. Gunpowder. Or one. Just one gunpowder. I'm going to save my glass. That's right, glass. Not cool. But, um, let's see here. Just so I can see. I guess I gotta make sure I have a way through. Sorry, glass. I hate breaking glass. Um, alright. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a current system that drops and just shoves the bad guys up to this wall, and there's going to be a drop-off right there, which I, I need to make. Hold on. That will drown the bad guy. And in fact, because he is this tall, I'm going to actually make the current system on this level of water so that he can drown right here, and this good stuff can come out right here. Because I don't want to make it too deep. This will all make sense in a, in, a, in a little bit. <laughs> Maybe. And then hopefully I can redirect the current that's coming out this way with the current system that I'm going to put going this way and I'll make a nice little spot for it to collect right here. We'll see how that works. Um, we need to build up a little bit more on this level. Yeah, I should be fine. I'm gonna put, put windows in there. Um, yeah. Yeah. I'm still, I'm still like thinking this out. I'm gonna make sure it's gonna work. I'm gonna make an infinite spring here. Because I'm gonna need more water than what I got, I think. And the way to do that, plenty of videos on YouTube. Basically, one bucket there, one bucket there. It evens out, and it will always even out. Um, let's make a little... That was dumb. A little walkway up. Alright. Alright. Again, I'm, I'm totally winging it here. I'm not positive of what I'm doing. But in theory, as soon as I add the water, it should work because it's going to blow these torches away and I'll start spawning. We'll see. Is it going to work? Nah, probably not. Oh yeah, I'm going to need a way to get <laughs> to more water. Got more buckets. A lot more buckets. Might as well 
really don't like replacing some of my tools with. Uh, so I don't need the glass anymore. Replacing things I need. <laughs> Buckets. Gah! <laughs> There's apparently more dungeon that way. Uh, yes, yes, brains. Whoops, hit the uh, distance of view button. Nope, I keep hitting it. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. Eh, yeah, why not? Let's do that. And we'll, to add more directional current, we'll do a little of that. I think we only really need one more. Let's see, is there still too much light, or is it not going to work underwater? Come on, spawn on the bad guy. Oh, he spawned. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, he kind of wants to go down, but he keeps jumping out. I don't think it's a far enough fall. Time to work on it. Um, go one level down. Play the current. Alright, there we go. That appears to be working. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Can only spawn? No. I can spawn more. And this should forever give me feathers. <laughs> Good show. Not that hard, actually. I heard a lot of people have problems, but it's really not that hard. Except for the, the one zombie that spawned in the wall. And they come right to me. That was really easy. Okay, so it's apparent I need to fill that in. And they may still even pop there, I don't know. Oh my god. <laughs> Do that again. Ow. Come here. In your face. I'm gonna call this and I'm gonna get out of here. I'm gonna explore this a little more after I've got some more ham, gotten a little more prepared. Is that what the hell is that? I just saw something. Oh, I think that's yeah, that's a lot of skeletons. There's a there's a lot of skeletons. Dungeon number two. Okay, if I can get like non-stop arrows. <laughs> GG everybody, GG. I need to I really need to figure out a better system of getting up. How about ladders? Oh yeah, it's dark outside still. Uh, I'll stay in here for a little bit. Um <laughs> Hopefully you found this informative. I'm gonna I'll go ahead and work on a way easier way down. Hopefully you found this informative. I I actually did. I, 
I didn't know as much as I did when I started this video. There we go. That I can put ladders on. And that is much more convenient. Might as well... No, that was dumb. I need to put one there. That one's gonna drop, but I'll pick it up. And... There. I should survive that drop. Yeah, you can really ration out uh, ladders pretty easily. <sighs> I'm gonna go ahead and... I can't take this water. Um, I'll go back, grab some water, because I just like to have a bucket with me. Oh, so it doesn't quite work. The current... Whoops. Uh, okay, a bucket. Uh, and drop it like right there. Uh, <laughs> didn't work. That didn't work. Uh, is it? Is it? Is it working? Uh, Did it actually push me in the hallway? No. Uh, ah. And now I can just add back those glass. Water's weird. Sometimes you just need to do something again, and then it... I bet I just effed it up again. We'll see. This guy drops feathers. Oh yeah, I need more water. I guess I'll just check if I get feathers on the way back. Two buckets. Plenty. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, fart. Oh, there we go. Seems to work pretty well and pretty efficiently. Oh my god. So many things spawn on the other side of this scary-ass wall I made. Okay. Um, probably gonna head back. God, it's still nighttime. Oh, it's turning day. I'm probably gonna head back, um, grab some meat, um, make a game plan. I see if there's anything else I want to build. Um, again, please feel free to ask me questions on building anything. I haven't really, uh, I'm not a pro or anything, but there's a lot of cool tricks I've found out. Um, uh, I'll, yeah, I'm either going to build something cool on the surface in this next video because it's daytime or else I'll come back in here and kick the living doo-doo out of some skeletons down in this direction. And then I'll farm them too. <laughs> if I can. Or I'll just get my butt kicked. But, um, I mean, don't, doesn't anybody want to congratulate me? I didn't die. Wait, did I die? I think I died. Maybe in an earlier video or something. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. Did the... Uh, I don't know if they updated again, but... Uh, in that one first video. Oh my god. They used to explode way the sh Shoot. I'm trying not to cuss. A lot of kids play this game. And now they're back to like their good old selves. Like, fairly tame. Unless they get right next to you for a second. Um... In my first combat video, they w were exploding without even getting that close to you, and um, I was the only one experiencing that. A lot of people did, actually. Um, let's see. Alright. I'm gonna head back to my house, grab some of my meat, continue on my next adventure, and I hope y'all will join me. Thanks for watching. I need to add one of those switches to my downstairs. Wow, did I even show y'all my downstairs? It's just a big blank room. Oh well. Um, <laughs> um, figured it'd be nice to exit on ground level sometimes, but I still always come to the front door. Anyway, thank you guys for watching, and thank you, for you like couple of guys for subscribing. Um, appreciate it. It's really hard to get off the ground um, on YouTube out of out of the blue. Uh, so appreciate it, and. Uh, Stay tuned.